Good morning everybody, I hope you are all doing really well. Today is Saturday and I don't usually start off vlog on a weekend, um, but I thought I would start to vlog on a weekend because there's a few things that I maybe, <laughs> that I think are maybe um, vlog worthy. So, this morning I have woke up really, really early um, and actually I was so, so bad. So, <laughs> basically, last night I went out for a meal with my friend. We stayed up till like nine o'clock, um, which is probably a little bit later than I would have anticipated. Um, and on my way home, I really didn't enjoy my dinner. Anyway, on my way home, I decided to get some cookie dough because the place I usually get it from, I have to, it's like nowhere near where I live, but I would be driving past it home. So I thought I would get some cookie dough last night. Didn't actually end up eating the cookie dough because I just wasn't feeling it. And then I woke up this morning and I ate the cookie dough. So now I've got loads of energy, um, so I'm gonna go do a workout. It's about half nine, I am getting my nails done at half 10, so I need to be really quick. Uh, I'm gonna do a quick hit workout um, just to get some energy, feel fresh and good again, and then go get my nails done. I've got some unboxings to do with you guys as well, so I'll do that at some point. Um, I think we're having a pretty chilled um saturday um i'm gonna hopefully i'm gonna go for a walk at some point but yeah let's go and work out to you guys it's now it's nearly seven o'clock in the evening um i've had these two packages with me for like two days now and i really want to see what's inside of them so i'm going to do an unboxing i forgot to show you guys my nails um so this is what i got done to my nails can you see them they're in this like peachy i got my nails painted in this kind of like peachy orangey color I'm not sure it's kind of coming across as a bit of an a nude on me for some reason but it's definitely more of a uh, kind of like fluorescent orangey peachy colour so yeah I, I never used to be one of those people that had to get their nails done and um, to feel themselves I know a lot of people I know a lot of people feel like that and I've never ever been like that but I'm becoming like that I just feel a lot more confident with my hands when they are painted anyway let me do a quick unboxing and show you guys um, a few bits that I have got I've got um, a pair of boots and some jewelry I think both of them are PR packages so um, these are my first um, shoes these are my first pair of boots um, of the year. Um, so yeah, they're from Moda in Pele. Um, I got a pretty, I got a pretty simple style. I wanted something just like really simple and um, something that I could wear a lot. I didn't want anything too extravagant. Um, just a good pair of everyday boots. This is a shoe box, and then let's have a look. <laughs> And then I just got a pair of black, simple, chunky boots. Um, these ones are actually, I think they're real leather. Yeah, these ones are actually real leather. I had a very similar pair from New Look last year, which I, to be fair, I still have and I still wear. But they were like a first grade material. Um, I wore them so much. Um, even when I had like my nine to five job, I would wear those shoes then. Um, so I thought these would be a better upgrade because they're leather. So yeah, this is what the boots look like. Very, very simple, just grey everyday boots. These are the boots. Um, if you've watched my trends video, then you would know that um, trinky boots are and platforms, all that kind of thing, are here to stay. So, and then in here, I have some jewellery from Monica Vinida. Um, so they contacted me on Instagram and asked if I wanted to try anything and I am a sucker for jewellery and I've heard amazing things about Monica Vinita jewellery so of course I was like yes. This is what the package looks like. So that's what the packaging looks like and then you just open it like so and then I think I know what's in here. Oh, maybe I don't. 
So in here I have a pair of the Doina. I don't know how to say this. I think I'm saying it correctly, but I'm not sure. But I think the, so. I think these are called the Doina Huggy Earrings. I love a good pair of Huggy Earrings. I just think, oh, they're incredible. So these are gold verme, um, and I do have quite a. I do have quite a lot of um, gold verme jewelry, so I know it's really, really good quality. I am a sucker for huggy earrings. I just think they're very simple, very laid back. So when I saw them, I had to had to have them. So in the next packaging, I really really like this purple packaging. Ooh. And this is the pouch. So I got the Mini Marie pendant with the fine beaded chain. I've seen so many people with the Mini Marie pendant um, and it looks great on everybody. This has been a necklace that's actually been on my wish list for quite a long time. So I'm so, so happy to have um, got this. It has really nice details on the pendant. It's absolutely stunning. Again, it's gold for me. Um, all of the jewelry I'm showing you today is gold for me. I can't wait to wear this necklace with all of my knits and my jumpers. Um, yeah. So the next piece which I picked up is the Fiji Bud Cuff. I really want to get into wearing more jewelry on my wrist. I just, I love that look and I just want to get into it. So um, I thought I would pick up. So yeah, I thought I would pick up this um, cuff so that I can get used to wearing bracelets and all that kind of thing. It's really, really comfortable on the wrist. It looks stunning and I really like it when um, people stack their bracelets. I love that look. So the final piece which I picked up is the Dino Wine Chain Bracelet. Excuse my scar, but this is just what the chain bracelet looks like. It's absolutely stunning. I love it so much. I really do feel like these two work perfectly together. Oh, I absolutely love this. It is so, so, so pretty. So yeah, those are the pieces which I got from um, Monica Finneder. Their jewellery is just so, so stunning. Um, I want to say a massive thank you to them for um, sending over these pieces because they are just so gorgeous. And I cannot wait to wear them more and more. Um, yeah. Oh love so 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 much yeah okay that was my unboxing um i think for the rest of the evening i'm gonna go downstairs and make dinner um yeah make dinner for jack and i and then we're just gonna chill for the rest of the we're just gonna chill for the rest of the evening actually i need to go and wash my hair so i'm gonna go make dinner um wash my hair and then um, just chill for the rest of the evening. And then actually, because it's bank holiday weekend, I think we're um, we're actually going out with some friends tomorrow because um, we've all got Monday off. I'll probably catch up with you tomorrow, show you guys my outfit that I'm wearing tomorrow, and um, yeah, we'll take it from there. Hi everyone, so this is several days later. I haven't vlogged for a few days. Um, it's been bank holiday weekend. Most people had yesterday off, which was Monday. Today is Tuesday and it's about, uh, it's nearly four o'clock in the afternoon. So yeah, I popped into town this morning because, well, I had to post something off. So I thought I might as well do that whilst I'm in town. Um, I sold a handbag and yeah, I posted that off. I thought I would film it come shopping with me and have a look around the shops and all, and all that kind of thing. But there's literally nothing that I even wanted and the shops were so busy which to be fair I was shocked because I was thinking I mean it was bank holiday weekend so we had a longer weekend um so I thought the shops would be quieter today because everyone's back at work but yeah the shops were really really busy so I didn't really feel that comfortable filming like Zara was absolutely packed and there really wasn't even that much that I wanted I've been on the market for the perfect black blazer I have Yet to I'm yet to find my perfect black blazer and we're coming into the season where black blazer is just going to be a staple. I know it's really boring um, but I really really want like the perfect one. I saw a really nice one in Zara and I tried it on. I liked it um, and but there's also one in Cos which I really really like but it's literally triple the price of the one in Zara. So I'm like oh do I want to spend that much money? I'm thinking it's worth spending it just because I will wear it so 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 much 
and um, even though the Zara blazers are really expensive, um, all of the Zara blazers which I've bought over time have bobbled and um, I know I can just buy a a shaver and whatever it's called shaver debobbler and I'm gonna do that anyway but um maybe the cosm will last a little bit better and not bobble I don't know anyway I'll include the very few uh clips I got from my come shopping with me now it's literally like two seconds long um I also had looking mango so yeah roll that now I'll make it worth your while we won't hide in the crowd Just stay with me And I'll make it worth your while 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 Make it worth your while 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 All the things I would do actually doing like a glamping um glamping um staycation event oh, sorry about the lighting i've been invited down to um it's like glamping if you know what glamping is then that's what it is so i've been invited down i've asked jack if he wants to come and he's agreed so we're going down there this afternoon and just trying out this new experience. I've never tried anything like this. I'm super, super, super excited um, to see what it's gonna be like. Yeah, I thought I'd vlog this afternoon and show you guys where we end up going. Um, yeah, we're gonna head off now. I'll quickly show you guys my outfit. I've packed my bag and yeah, let me show you my outfit and then we'll go. Okay, so this is my very boring, plain, simple outfit that I'm gonna be wearing today. Um, I pretty much wore the same thing when I went to London last weekend, so yeah. Um, jacket is Primark, jeans are Abercrombie, trainers are New Look, um, and then I've got my Louis Vuitton Prashant Tees, and my t-shirt is from New Look as well, so yeah. Hi everyone, so we have arrived at the um, place. So we're at Hornington Manor, and yeah, we've just arrived, and honestly, I'm so, I'm blown away, I'm completely, honestly blown away by just how amazing this place is um yeah it didn't take us too long to drive either um but yeah i'll give you guys a little tour of the place and what it looks like so this is what the um huts look like and we're staying in that one that was called the egypt egypt egyptologist so, um and i'm not I can't remember what this one is called but just look how lovely they are like they all look so nice so cozy i think there's six or seven of the huts and yeah they're all like this and they obviously then face the countryside so it's just perfect i just think this is perfect if you're looking for like a staycation if you're based in yorkshire then yeah i think this is yeah then yeah, i think this is perfect if you are looking for a little staycation you want to get away you want to get away from the city and all that so yeah all right let me show you guys our hut so this is what it looks like when you walk up and this is what our hut looks like from the outside um and as you walk in i'll try to find the lights Ah, oh, there we go, perfect. So yeah, this is what our hut looks like. So we've got a little kitchenette, is that what you call it, a kitchenette? Some plates, an oven, and then this is our bed. And I really like the Egypt theme. Um, it just looks really, really nice. We've got our towels, and then behind me, this is what it looks like. Got a little sofa. That's me. Pictures of Egypt throughout, which is love the little touches. And then we've got this little door. And then you come in here. And let me try to find the light. And yeah, this is our bathroom. It's really nice and clean. And again, 
Oh, let me turn that on. Ooh, love that. Absolutely love that. Yeah, this is me. This is this is a little tar. I'll catch up with you guys later. Right now, I need to do some stories because this is an Instagram campaign. So we're just walking around, discovering the place. We're just having a look around the grounds and just seeing what there is to see, really. Um, it's kind of in the middle of nowhere, so it's just a perfect staycation, like if you want to get away from everything. Um, so yeah, and then I think we're going to grab some food in a bit because we're both really hungry. Uh, but we're going to have to like, drive out and find somewhere, which we don't mind, of course. So yeah. Somewhere down the line. So we're just having a look around the actual manor. It's so so beautiful. We changed and we grew and we fell out of touch as time goes by. Still I'm holding on to I know that it's time for me to let you go. I know that it's time for us to part. Breaks my heart, baby. It's time for me to face the truth and say it out loud. I don't know you anymore. just had a look around the whole place it's absolutely amazing i didn't actually realize that this place is also a wedding venue so they've like set it up for weddings it looks really really nice um anyway we are now heading out to get some food um we're both fancying like really like pub grub food is it is that what you call it pub grub food like really cozy stodgy even like a roast dinner it's a tuesday and i'm craving a roast dinner <laughs> Um, it's very random, but yeah, so um, I'll show you guys the food um, and where we eat and all that when we get there oh, you. Oh, I wish it wasn't true. I know that it's time for me to let you... That is it for today. We are both exhausted and tired. The food was amazing. The Yorkshire puddings were absolutely massive. Like, I didn't think that they were going to be that big, but it was so big. Um, I didn't finish mine. Jack did, actually. <laughs> um, but, yeah, they were so good. So, yeah, I'm just going to um, get a shower, get ready for bed, um, watch a movie tonight, and just chill. I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow. Good morning, everybody. It feels so good to wake up here. Um, there's literally sheep right outside of our hut. Um, I'm gonna show you. <laughs> Look at the sheep. They're right there. How cute. I don't know why they've been separate. I feel like these sheep here have been separated from the other sheep. And, and they keep just like standing there. Like even when we came home last night, they were just like stood there. Um, they just wanna be reunited with their friends. It's quite sad actually. So I'm just making myself some breakfast. Uh, I've had a shower, got ready. Um, I'm making myself some breakfast. Um, they've left us some crumpets. Ooh, that's my crumpet. Um, so I'm just gonna have that. We're gonna get ready and head on home. We are cutting it a little bit short because um, it's nearly nine o'clock and we haven't got today off as holiday. So we need to get back really quick. I'll catch up with you guys when I'm home. Mm -hmm. 